Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul. Yep, I know what? Jenny has a Dollar Tree haul. No, yeah, I do. And I did find some new items and I'm excited what I found because this is going to be perfect for Christmas for my little ones. So I'm going to start off with some new items that I found. First, I found two new keychains, which are, I thought were pretty awesome. These are keychain, well, I guess it just says keychain but they almost look like a galaxy. So they had two different ones. So I picked up that one. You see that one? They are heavy as well. It would almost be a weapon. It's so heavy. And then there is this one. So I thought those were cool. And these were up by the register and it's in a round clear container and it says keychains on it. Um, I found some food coloring at the Dollar Tree. Yes at the Dollar Tree and it expires on 9-16-2020 so I think we have plenty of time to use up the food coloring and that's perfect timing for Christmas which is right around the corner to make or even Halloween cookies or for Thanksgiving Christmas cookies anything like that and Ava uses this some of it sometimes for her slime she uses everything for slime so I thought that was a cool find that uh, it's from Spice Supreme. So I thought that was cool that you can get food coloring out at the Dollar Tree. Um, I found some garland. This is like for the mini trees. So I thought this would be cute for either my little tree or I have an idea on something else. But whoo, see how that popped right out? It almost popped out like a zit. Oh, I hate those kind. I used to pop those on my dad's neck and they came out like a worm and, it's a, and they shatter like a paintball thing oh there goes Jojo but anyway this is the gold this is 20 feet long it's by um, Christmas house they had green red silver or gold pretty much all their stuff that's the choice of colors that you have nowadays so I went ahead and picked that up and I thought it was absolutely adorable so we will see what that will be used for I also found some more of the Christmas lights. These are the LED 10 count. It's three feet long. It takes two AA batteries and you will need a little screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver, to open the little thingamadoober. And what's cool is if you didn't want the multiple, the multi-colored, all you have to do is, well, maybe, <laughs> no, no, not. Usually they pop right off, but these little suckers don't want to pop off. All the other ones you can pop off. So I don't know, but it's multicolored. So how cute is that the next thing that I bought um, I bought two of them I bought this last year for my mom and I paid $8.99 and I thought that was a bargain no now it's a bargain because it's only a dollar this is the um, three second rapid repair laser bond USA works on um, it works on plastic metal rubber wood glass and much more so um, it says just apply seal with light and all like new again. So I thought that was interesting and I don't even know if my mom used hers yet. So I don't know, we'll see if this thing works. Um, it says push, so I'm pushing it. You can see the light turn on. So I went ahead and picked up two, just in case if it works, we have a backup. But you never know, some of the stuff as seen on TV doesn't work. Um, I bought a couple of more of these. I know some of you are still looking for them, so I thought I would just pick a couple and you just never know when you might get one in the mail. So I picked up two more of these. These are the um, um, notebook pads from John, John, you rock. Yes, this is 80 pages. And it says always be yourself unless you can be a unicorn. Then always be a unicorn. And that is the inside. Totally cute. Love the design. Love the saying. I thought it was cute. So I picked up two more. Um, I picked up another new journal. This is by um, a no name company because there's nothing on it but I'll just pretend it's Jock. Um, this is a 60 sheet book um, tablet and um, I have not opened it so let's figure out how to open this together. Feels like I'm on Sesame Street. But they have three different designs. I thought this one was cool so I picked up this one and the pages it's kind of like an off-white and eating the hair so that is what the inside looks like so I thought it was cute perfect for like Christmas and that since it's kind of Christmassy looking and my hair is sorry I'm having an itch attack oh, hair allergies um who remembers these wacky wacky packages 
Um, this is by Top. Um, this is like a value jumbo pack. You get 23. Yes, they normally, um, at the Dollar Tree, you used to get like only like three cards. No, now you get 23. And for a dollar, if you bought this, say, let's say at Target, it's probably going to run you between six to eight dollars for a pack of these. So I picked up um, three of them. So I'm going to put these in my kids' stocking, so I am not going to be able to open these. But just be sure you look over by all their cards and that, and make sure that you look in all the boxes, because th this set right here was in a baseball card one. It was not in a wacky pack box. So just don't scan through the box. Look inside. Look. Um, and then I bought a wacky pack Major League Baseball one. You get 22 in there and two exclusive stickers. So I thought that would be cool for my little man. So I picked up one of those for him. Sticking with the Wacky Pack theme, um, I picked up some of the Wacky Packages erasers. You get three in there, and they are by Tops as well. These are probably about, mm, I would say about $4.99, maybe at like Meyer, Walmart, Target. So I went ahead and picked up, um, let's see, one, two, three, Four. and you know what let me just I thought I had more in there nope I don't I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and open one so I you guys can get an idea on what they look like so if you have someone that likes erasers I know some people um, collect erasers these would be perfect and it does come with um, two stickers so that is one sticker right there so you can add those to like your sticker book or um, a tablet or something and it does oh I just dropped it and it rolled underneath yeah the lazy susan on here <laughs> I can't. I can't. oh i'm gonna break my table oh there we go i got it wait did i show you three it came with three stickers did i show you all three oh my god total brain fart i don't even know jojo no 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 nope she's barking at the neighbor's dog hey cycle bird's back hi cycle bird hi welcome back to my backyard Oh, it's a blue jay. That's who's screaming. It's a blue jay. Go away. It listened. Must not be related because any people related to me don't listen. But anyway, there's an eraser. They smell like rubber. Okay. Yeah, I would say rubber. So there's a red Coke can and a thing of like lifesavers. And like I said, these are erasers. So these are pretty cool. What are Oh, it's like the beans. It's um old El Gasso. How funny is that? I don't know if that's gonna focus or not. My luck it probably won't. But anyway, that is um what they look like if you have someone in your family or know someone that would like those for only a buck. I say go for it. And if you do like a little package like with these at that, that'd be cute. Um and it does come with a checklist, so I will just stick that up there like that. I can't believe that was a blue jay. All that time that I've been doing my recordings outside, it was a blue jay. I thought it was some freaking rare embry bird or something. Now, oh, I forgot about these. These are by Christmas House too. Um, yeah, I looked on the back. You just don't get that design. You get 10 if you read right there, which of course I didn't read it. I flipped it over and I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to find those right there with the Frenchie. So I'm digging through the box of all these cards. I'm like, oh yeah, it says 10 different ones. Duh. So I opened it after I bought it, by the way. So these are the cards that you get. And a cardinal, how cute is that? Oh, I so cute. Yes, that's my... That's my JoJo language. Um, there is that one, which I thought was adorable. And then you have Santa and the Santa and the Choo Choo and the deer and the gingerbread house, which I wish was here now because I would eat it because I'm starving. And then that one. So yes, these box of cards, um, I think they had three different sets. Um, so be sure you look on the back because on the back it is going to show you what cards you get. So I thought that was cool that you get 20 of them for a dollar and they're different. I picked up a box of these. I have not tried these ones before, if that makes any sense what I just said. They're bite-sized maple cream cookies. It's a seven ounce box. 
So I went ahead and picked up a box of those to see what they taste like. Um, also, I hauled these before, and this is an awesome buy. I if you have little ones, oh, I do have another one. See, I knew I had another one, so there is another one. Um, these are awesome. It comes with a bag, and you get um, six Go-Go's. Now, if you're familiar with these, usually you get a pack of two, and they're about three bucks a pack for two of them. You get six and a pack, and they're also a cheat, cheat or a window in the back, which I did not know until I seen the lady moving them around. But if you can see that blue thing, it comes with a little baggy carrying case thing, and then you get six of these figures. Even Alex loves playing with them, and I could not believe that they had them for a dollar. They do have a two pack, but if you dig up in the box, these suckers were stuffed up there, and you better believe I sniffed them out, and I grabbed them, and I bought them. So, there's different seasons. So I bought um, four of the red, and I think they just had one of this green one. So I went ahead and picked up this green one, and then I picked up three of these. And awesome stock, stocking stuffers, or you can keep them up for like um, goodie bags or for birthday parties or something. Um, and they only had one of these in the box, which was stuck to the side. And this is series two. And it looks like you get um, five, four, five. You get five of the Go-Go's, these little thingy-me-doobers, and you get nine stickers and one bonus sticker. So I just thought that was really cool. And that's what that bag looks like. And there's 80 of them to collect. So I thought that was cool. So I picked that up. Um, I picked up one of the Yo-Kai, yo watch, yo Yoko, whatever. It's a dog tag. Alex loves dog tags. He has so many hanging on his wall. So I figured, you know what, for a dollar, there she goes. There she goes. So I picked up one of those for him. I also did buy The Home is Where Your Story Begins. This is the nail art. Um, one of you, which I have to go back to see who wanted this. I think um, she wanted this one and I love you to the moon and back or something so I do have both of those for you so if I do not contact you contact me and let me know if you're still interested in these if so um, I can get those mailed out to you and the last thing I bought is the sketch pad you get 40 sheets Ava loves to draw um, that's what she wants for Christmas is some really nice um, coloring pencils and drawing pencils and um, smeary pencils, whatever that is, it must be a new thing, I don't know. But this paper is kind of thick and it's nicely made actually. It's not thin, yucky paper, so I thought that was really cool. So I'm going to keep this up for her for her birthday because it's in December right before Christmas and give her some um, markers and colored pencils and stuff like that. So yeah, you can find a lot of that good stuff at the Dollar Tree. So that is what I bought today. So. Be sure you keep a lookout for that magic number because, like I said, you never know where it's going to pop up. I'll add a um, short video at the end, and it just tells you what um, contests and giveaways that I'm doing. So if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down. Be sure you click on to that subscribe button. Click on to that little bell if you want to be notified as soon as I post. I thank you for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Keep smiling. Okay, so I thought I would do a cute little game and there's a bee flying around my arm. Nature is not kind to me. But anyway, I'm going to try to do a fun game. Week, I'm going to put a number somewhere throughout the video. I'm only going to be on there one time for that video. So be sure you look out for it. It's going to be anywhere. So just be sure you keep looking. It might be in, you know, a different shape or a different color. It's going to be somewhere throughout my video. So you keep track of the numbers that I post Monday through Sunday. Make sure you have them in order. And the first person to comment on my video on Sunday, all the numbers in the right order will win a $5 gift card to the Dollar Tree. And the only way you're going to win is if you have sent mail or will be sending mail and I have your information because I have all your guys's information written down in a tablet so I have your name and address so as long as you have been entered in all my giveaways and have sent mail you are able to win a five dollars gift card <laughs> Oh,
All you need for this candy cane is the candy cane wire, two packages of the mesh of your choice of color, and any of the um, Christmas lights um, or Thanksgiving lights and just poke those right through. I put the battery pack right there on the bottom and you'll need two AA batteries. So that's all you need to make this candy cane. For this wreath, all you need is the wreath wire. You're gonna need a little over two bags of the tubing. Um, I just added some of the um, snowflake lights and then just your choice of ornament. And that's all you need for that. For this Christmas tree, all you need is the Christmas tree um, cut out. I add a little bit of the miniature um, tinsel and one package of the LED wire lights. And you'll need two AA batteries. For this one, all you need is the snowflake cut out, um, paint it whatever color you want, and I added one strand of the LED lights right around the edges and just taped it on the back. For this one, all you need is a wine bottle, paint it to whatever color you want. I added some more of the miniature tinsel and one strand of the LED lights and I put a gold star ornament and you will need some double A batteries. For this one, all you need is a wine bottle painted to whatever, whatever color you want. I chose white, I used some of the glitter ribbon, and I added one of the stars. And that's all you need. I will go into more detail on how I made this and everything at a later date. I just wanted to show you what I've been working on. So which one is your favorite?